Yeah, you can tell me. Okay, this is the Aquan pole at Cayman's Park. It is designed particularly by the former promoters. And it has paid, paid its dues by substituting for the sea. In, in, a, in a short while, I will elaborate the difference between swimming in the equine pool and swimming at the sea. The open gate show has just shown you the two places that the horses swim, the equine pool and at the beach. There's a difference. Some horses walk to the sea, which is much, much better. Yes, it is a little bit more dangerous, but at the, at the sea, it's, not, it's much more harder to swim because the water is tighter and, you know, it's open sea and it's much better. I should, I should tell you. Okay, the difference now with the equine pool, the equine pool is much lighter and it's cheaper and it's right in the proximity of the complex. Now, what swimming does for a horse? A fit horse, swimming at the pool will keep that horse fit. But to, to get a horse, a horse that is on race or just learning to, to, to run, it bears no effect. As a matter of fact, it, 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 it would work backwards. But the main purpose of swimming a horse, what it does, the capillary bed. When a horse leaves the farm, the capillary bed, which is, which is situated in the lungs, is, it, it, it's a very small bed. It's like when you're a youngster and you have this little one, this bed that can hold only, only, can hold only one person. Now, as the exercise program progresses, the capillary bed expand, and it expand more and more. The fitter the horses get, is the more it expand. Now, with it being expanded to a, to to to, an ex, to to a certain level, you have more um, carbon dioxide and, and oxygen exchange in that big bed. In the smaller bed, there's not much exchange that can have. So the main aim is to get the capillary bed as big. As, as bigger, uh, the biggest way it can. Well, each horse has a, a different size capillary bed to reach. So, you know, the point I'm making, the bigger the capillary bed, is the more exchange of carbon dioxide and oxygen uh, will be, of which the horse will run better. So, the aim of training a horse gradually is to have that capillary bed expanded. And, and as I said, the capillary bed is, is located in the lungs. Now, the swimming pool, a fit horse, it can keep the horse fit, maintain some level of fitness because the, the, the lungs are, the lungs are, are being exercised on, on a regular basis. Why some horses swim? Well, there are ailments, mainly leg ailments or any other physical ailments that occurs on a horse. It alleviates the stress on those points. Instead of going to the racetrack where Everything, the, the, every, every aspect of the horse, the joints, the ligaments, the tendons, everything, the muscles are being used. Unlike swimming, the only muscles that are used in swimming is really the, the muscles that surround the lungs and, and, and the diaphragm and the cardiac muscles, etc. etc. The, the muscles used for swimming, 99% of them are not used 
when the horse is racing on the track or, or even exercising on the track. Different set of muscles. For example, let me get, put it more better. A shimmer, if, you know, it, 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 that doesn't mean a good shimmer that, that trains for the Olympics. To run, you'll be surprised how slow he runs, but he's very fit. Yes, because that lung capacity and, and the, the, the capillary bed is, is, is what is needed for that type of, of um, uh, that type of sport. But with a horse, everything is needed. So I hope you understand. The Open Gate Show is trying its best to help fans and others understand more about horse racing. And thank you very much. And remember to subscribe and tell others about the Open Gate Show so they can join in. Take care.